I am Brittany Montez, and this is the Orlando Health News Review for October 3rd. Creative therapy can brighten a patient's world and improve treatment outcomes. Recently, the team from Kendra Cares, a unique program that brings the magic of the color bar by Kendra Scott to pediatric hospitals, offered patients at Orlando Health Arnold Palmer Hospital the opportunity to design a piece of customized jewelry at no cost. We bring our mobile color bar so that the um, children are able to create their own piece of jewelry, customize it, and take it home with them that day. And um, so just a way for us to bring a little sunshine to uh, Arnold Palmer today. This is our second time in 2018, so we're just excited to see through the rest of the year the impact Orlando Health and Kendra Scott can make together. And October is National Cybersecurity Awareness Month. This month, a special edition of Compliance in Action newsletter specifically focused on Cybersecurity Awareness Month will include games that team members can complete and submit for a chance to win a prize. Compliance and Ethics will be traveling to different departments to educate users about cybersecurity and other important compliance topics. Cybersecurity is such an important topic globally and internationally and also for Orlando Health. Healthcare has become a large target by the cyber criminals. Um, we have a lot of records, patient records, we have a lot of team member records, and um, it has been a focus of their efforts over the last couple of years. So we must remain vigilant in our security efforts. Whether it's internet links, whether it's email, scrutinize and have a, have a sense of um, suspicions on everything that you're not aware of. And during October, you will also see cybersecurity and compliance screensavers displayed on computer screens. Next, Panera Bread Pink Ribbon Bagels are back for Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And for the entire month of October, a portion of the proceeds from all Pink Ribbon Bagel sales in Orlando will be donated to Orlando Health UF Health Cancer Center, with 100% of the proceeds being donated for Pink Ribbon Bagels sold on October 5th. Visit SWIFT to order today. And let's see who's putting promise in action. I think it's important for us to make our, our team members feel um, comfortable in the role that they're there for, in the role that they're supposed to be playing, and empowering our nurses and our staff to do what is right for the patient and to be confident in what they do. I took ownership with my patient by making sure that he was able to get his medications on a Friday afternoon when it was right before a holiday weekend. He was uninsured, not able to afford his medications, and he needed them as being a brand new heart failure patient. So I came in here to talk to Stacy to see what we could do. Stacy got on the phone with Quinetta, who's a pharmacist. From five o'clock on, we were on the phone back and forth calling him. It was 9.30 when we stopped having our conversations and we knew that he finally had his medications and had started taking them. We don't want patients to readmit back into the hospital, so we find any and any way we can. And so that was one of the things I know Patty did. She spent time trying to make sure we were able to, to do those things for that patient. Taking ownership is how you make a difference. It's just another way that you put promise in action. And we have a hot fact in honor of National Cybersecurity Awareness Month. Did you know that on average 15,000 spam emails are blocked per day at Orlando Health? And just in June this year, 23 million spam emails were blocked? Well, that's it for today's edition of the Orlando Health News Review. Thank you for making Orlando Health the best hospital possible. See you next week.